it's a good thing I didn't give him this information because now, look, he learned everything, and now you're saying, well, I wish I would have done something so we didn't lose that 40000 So that's where well, do you I, I think that define that. And you have a that. great point, but I think, we, I think one, of the, one of the things that successful people do is they create an environment of hard times while times are good. So, and I think that's what the gardens did. Like, things were good. We were you know, going to make money, but there was a hard time created out of a good, out of, out of a good market, you know? So, we know what to do when right. things are suffering now. Like, it's not like we're oblivious to that. Yeah, and and then that's what I'm saying. Like, the, I think the same lessons could have been learned on a productive, on, on, a, on one of our own projects that didn't have that baggage. That's, that's why I have some regret. But uh, at the end of the day, forty thousand dollars well spent, I believe. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I agree. But it, it, that that job, there was so many scenarios and so much to learn from that job because there was the whole the the GC to start out in the game. He was the type to like do whatever type of person. Yeah, the super. It it it, it, uh, it aligned with the whole uh, custom what, homes. What and job what were you talking about? The Twilla the job. Twilla job. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right. So the, it started out that way. Uh, I we got a whole new crew, and come to find out later on, they only had like the, their head guy only had two years experience. Uh, so there was a lot to that job that. The turn it, it was the, the perfect storm. Yeah, I it agree. really was. Well, how many? How and, many times? Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not justifying myself because that's that job. I learned so much. I was ready to quit because I was so broken as a person in my self development that I didn't think that I could do it when that job went down because I came into it with the mindset of, I know what the hell I'm doing, but a very humbling experience for me to say the least. That's what I got to say too. Is it, it's not because it works hard or that you don't know what's going on because you, we did have cancel. I I say you didn't teach that. I mean, that was, you know, half a joke because I never, anytime you would call you, you give good advice, you know, being in the industry and doing that. But like Zoop said, the biggest thing that, that gave you the hardest time was the self-disappointment. Like, am I the reason why we're not making enough? Or am I the reason why we're getting all these threats and stuff from the GC because yeah. he didn't like this or he didn't like that. Sure. Um, and and I, I haven't failed at anything that I've tried. And, and that's probably because I haven't put myself in a big enough stage to fail, but it it starts making you wonder if that's going to be the first one, and, and that's hard. Yeah, it's I, hard. It, it, I think we, I think in any 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 success, uh, I I think you have to be good with and with failure. Honestly, yeah. like that doesn't mean we want it. Right, but like you can't let failure weigh you down and, right. and, and stop you, from heading yeah. after the more and, success. And you only fail when you when you quit. Right, and I get that, but that was where I was at. <laughs> <laughs>